When you entertain, how would you describe your entertaining style? Fun and relaxed. Yeah. I, I live on uh, I live on the water in Savannah, Georgia, and am really fortunate. And the weather is good the majority of the year, so we like to grill. We like to throw the football and baseball and play games and. So you're not stressing over no, like God, the party no, favors or the Are napkin. If I'm stressing origami. at my house. <laughs> no, 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 definitely not. Definitely not. No, we make it fun. You and get it everybody fun. involved. Would that be your entertaining tip for the guys? Like don't, <laughs> entertaining tip? don't worry about it so much. Just just throw it out there. Don't worry about setting uh, this high bar for yourself. Just kind of break some eggs and get I, into it. I, I think that that's good advice. I, th I, I think that we stress out about enough stuff. Food shouldn't I be know. stressful. No, no Food stressing. should be fun. It should be fun. Company should be fun. Food should be fun. Have what? a good time. One of our favorite things to do in Savannah and yeah. Charleston and in, in the low country up there is called a low country boil. This is a very communal Ooh. way to eat. I, I don't Ooh. know if you're familiar. I'm not. Tell us about okay. the low, low country boil. That's the first time I've heard it. Is potatoes, corn on the cob, yeah. sausage, and uh, shrimp. And it's all ah. done in one big pot. And you drain it and then just pour it all out on a table on newspaper and everybody grabs oh a beer. Oh my gosh. Not even trip. plates <laughs> you bought on plates, newspaper. Nobody's wearing shoes. No tablecloth. <laughs> I, love, I love your style. Yeah, it's so, simple. What, what advice would you give to the guys? Like we need like dudes to start hosting and entertaining. And a lot of them are kind of, they love food, right? And they love to cook, yeah. right you guys? You love to cook, you love wine. How do the dudes like get it together and take it to that next hmm. level? Do you have any advice? That's a good question. I am, have been really fortunate and my mom has, has blazed a trail for my brother and me where we got great opportunities, but I wouldn't uh, trade the fact that my mother taught me how to cook and how to clean up after myself when I was young. And that really, maybe that's why I got married so late in life because I knew how to take care of myself. But you didn't, uh, that's even better. Could, you teach, don't need someone, you want your, someone. I think teach your kids to cook. Teach, uh, teach the young men to cook. I meet a lot of kids, especially boys, and ask them if they like to cook, and they're like, no, I don't like to cook. It's like, look, son, yeah. anybody can make a reservation. Yeah, that's you know right. What I'm saying? But if you can cook, you get the rest. What was the favorite, your most favorite party that you've ever thrown? that you've ever given uh, or a dinner you, party. You know what I do well is, is Super Bowl parties because those are ah! super laid back. It's easy stuff to do. It's a bunch of guys and it's just raucous. Yeah. So that's that's my regular. People come to my house for the Super Bowl. Okay. Yeah. You've been such know, a maybe. pleasure. Oh, I thanks. can't tell you. My pleasure. Uh, you. you guys heard thanks it here from Bobby Dean. He's got your tips for you. All you dudes out there, get your aprons on, <laughs> get in the kitchen, break some eggs. Don't stress about it, just have some fun. Thanks for watching, I'm Liza for Evite.